nice. But bitches wanted me. They said they know my body smoking. Smoking hot like Reese's. Ah. <laughs> ah. What's going on, Sing Ace? This is back motherfucking video, bitch. As you can see from the title, it is about that time for us to go ahead and kick it off the next era of this motherfucking um, review chapter. Um, I have not been on baddies. I'm sorry. Baddies have just not really been giving me with this game. I do this with like almost every show that I be reviewing. Like I'll start reviewing it extra heavy and I'll just fall off because baddies just be a fool. Like the only thing that really happened last episode was they argued at the damn lunch table. Stunning got into it with Tommy. Then they was trying to fight. Then Krishan smacked Natalie. Then Natalie ran up on Scotty for two seconds. I was like, I'm tired of these two second one, two, three ABCS fights, baby. I want to see the big whams and a big bam. So now, go ahead and get to South Central Baddies. As y'all know, Real Young Part 1 dropped today, so that means it's going to be a lot of vlogs and, you know, feeds going crazy. You know, when that happens, you don't have to come and report for duty. So that's what I'm doing, baby. I'm here, I'm here ready to go to work. Trying to get that YouTube check, okay? I see from the top, this is going to be for South Central Baddies Reunion Episode 1. Okay, so with that being said, this is like... No other um reunion has dropped yet for any other shows. Um, I know Zodiac House is still going on, and I know um Deja Vu was a good show too. But I haven't seen no other reunions. But South Central Betty said came with me because y'all know that's what the people want to see. I know y'all excited about this, and I'm actually excited to finally get into the show. I'm gonna actually start from the beginning and um review like um just like the episodes too, just to you know refresh everybody on what's going on in the reunion so that'll be coming out pretty soon so we're gonna start off the episode with they um promoting this new show with uh sapphire y'all know sapphire from jocelyn um cabaret she got her own show now and i guess like you know she trying to do her big legs when everybody trying to you know get they profit profitization off of you know they show on zeus until this now so i guess you know it's her turn next stage they got <coughs> Y'all know my two favorites, Jocelyn and Sky. They got them in the back. They said that they not here to fight. Jocelyn said she's the queen. She's gonna remain the queen. Like she's not here to you know explain why she's the queen. She just want y'all to bow down and kiss her toes. Understandable. Lindsay and Barbie scene, you know, as usual, they look a mess. I mean, I'm not gonna say they look a mess, but they do look a mess. I'm sorry, like Barbie look a fool, like that beauty supply ass dress with them fucking. Versace as Prince on and then Kenzie girl you came in some dukes and in a sweaty and I understand Kenzie get a pass because Kenzie be bang a hoe so I know she just she suited up and ready to go y'all know Kenzie my bitch I love me some Kenzie oh y'all don't know because I ain't fucking talked about this yet but my favorites is Joyce, Kenzie, Liddy and I don't like Nina um and Cashmere I love Cashmere even though her big nasty yuck mouth ass be doing too much on tans Cashmere's entertaining that bitch is TV is that like when she had that water bottle and she was trying to throw it on, on um, butter and then they had to take it home like that was so funny. They, um, they see each other I, I guess outside backstage and then Kenzie say like oh bitches got on prom dresses da 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 da. I think um, Joyce looked cute no shade like I feel like her, her look was actually you know kind of sick and she wanted to come out and show the girls like bitch I'm I'm mother to this shit like I'm very real housewife you bitches are very like South Central baddies so no shade. I live for Joyce y'all know because I'm biased and I'm a city bitch you know I gotta ride with the city bitches y'all know South Central is like the country a little bit it's really Ghetto, but like you know, them New York bitches, and that's right back motherfucking Chicago. You know, New York and Chicago, we like this, so it's like, yeah, when all that I, I shit, all that popping, all that shit, bitch, that's keep it for another bitch. Joyce and Sky come out first, of course, and they say about how old they is, and then Joyce is only 21, and Sky is 22, which is really crazy because I'm 22, so like these are some really young bitches getting on shows. Asking what they expect from the union, they said they just expect a whole bunch of bitches coming out acting crazy. I mean, we all expected that too, that's why we're here to tune in. Bring up Jocelyn getting jumped at the auditions, and how like, you know, how she felt about that, and if her and Butter still got a few, and she said she never had a problem with Butter, really, she just got her a mouth, which is understandable, because she never really tried to like fight her, she just always fuck on her, because she like, she irritated. And bump 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 Dun, dun, dun. My girl Barbie and Kenzie come the fuck out. Well, I live for Kenzie. I'm sorry. I'm not a fan of Barbie. I just feel like she be, she a pick me type of girl. Like, I feel like she a little older. So, like, she be trying to, like, put on for the camera. Like, be like oh, so-and-so beat me up. And so-and-so, I did this. And it's like, girl, 
Don't say nobody beat you up, first of all. If you feel like, you know, she a man and she, you know, running up on you just because she feel like she can beat you, then you need to just be harassed and get it over it. But you keep trying to break up excuses about, you know, people saying that you got beat up, girl. Don't care don't care about what nobody got to say about you. If they feel like you got beat up, then that's how they feel. But don't try to explain yourself 60,000 times. I don't like that. I feel like you're trying to, like, make people like you. And, you know, that's very noticeable. You know, when you a likable bitch and bitches just like you off the strength of you just being an amazing bitch, you don't got to try so hard, mama. You know? Barbie walk out um, real real funny yeah talking about some what the fuck um Barbie got on which is true because she be looking mess on shade I'm sorry Barbie I know you think you ate that that dress was a fool now if it was like a solid gold dress it would have ate but the prints threw it all off of me I'm sorry so now Barbie putting on her tennis shoes and they asking Barbie like she finna pop off she's like no I'm just getting ready because everybody be getting snaked so then Kenzie take her shoes off and Josh like her feet's not done <laughs> and this is why I like Josh because. That girl be reading, like, she don't need to fight you. Like, she will read you down, like, to the dust, like, to the floor before she even has to put her hands on you. That's why they hate her so much, because she been reading their ass the whole season. She said, oh, yeah, that's not me, and I'm not that, though. <laughs> I love you some Jocelyn. Like, she just been eating the girls up. She said, I didn't say the baby was ugly. I said the baby, I said, <laughs> I said the baby father was ugly, and she looked like him. Like, she's eating. I'm sorry. She give you very cigarette popping her shit. That's just me. Like, she got a fast talking mouth because she grew up in a fast city. So, if you grew up in a fast city, you got to make sure your mouthpiece is on a hundred. And that's just what them girls do. And that's why I fuck with them. They just them girls. I'm sorry. They just my favorites. No shade. I mean, I live for Liddy too. It's just like, the whole trans thing that goes on with Liddy does bother me because I feel like she be trying to say, oh, yeah, I beat up on trans women. Like, I'm the, I'm the girl that's, like, trying to put on for, for, for cisgender women beating up on trans women. And we're not going to start any more trans hate because trans women already have a lot of hate to begin with. So for you to be trying to start this whole, oh, are we trade girls beating up the other? Pipe it. Thanks. They um, really sitting pretty. Like, no shade. The Barbie and Kenzie up yelling at them and shit. They really sitting at their legs crossed looking at them hoes like, baby, we not fighting y'all. Like, y'all look a man. It was really like sickening. No shade. It was like, girl, we not fighting you, boo. Like, it's not it's not happening. No shade. So then now um they get some water. Kenzie's like, yeah, let's get some water. And then Josh say, um, no, bitch, you need some water with her dirty ass. And she start like reading her again, calling her strong, saying you're a man, like just like going up on her, you know. Kenzie got her shirt on that say, um, you can't do this though. That was funny though. I like that. I like that tagline. I do feel like Kenzie got some better one liners than that. You can't do this though, but it was still funny that she was just like these girls talking all that smack, but they can't fight, and that's really sickening. But Joyce did do her big one when they fought. No shade. When they fought hit up, no shade. I wasn't expecting Joyce to really go crazy like she did, but she definitely got her licks in with Kenzie. But we're going to get that one. Yeah, that's what I eat. We say um, they did put on for, for trans girl, and she want to have dialogue. And I, this is another thing where I do no live for Barbie at times because she does like try to like be united. And she was in the house talking about unity and how like the girls was calling those them trainees and calling about their names. She's like, if you're talking about me or you're talking about her, then you're talking about everybody. So it's like you can't be saying, you know, transphobic slurs and thinking it's just targeted to one person. If you say a transphobic thing, it's targeted to all trans women, no matter who you're talking to. I don't know what the reason was or why did they get up, but Sky and Jocelyn gets up, girl. That's why all this shit start happening, girl. <laughs> they get up, girl. They walk us to the back. So, you know, Kenzie get up too, and, you know, Jocelyn tried to do Kenzie little one, like, you know, I turn my back on bitches. You know, I'm not gonna do that little one. I turn my back on bitches. And you already know, Kenzie's not one of them girls. Kenzie not with that yip and that yap. She's talking about, oh, you turning your back on me, bitch? Watch this. And she got the young soldier boy through her shit, no shade, and got the crack in her shit. So now, of course, my girl Sky jumped in. It was just a whole bunch of scuffling. I really couldn't see what happened for real. It was like a lot of like security grabbing and like a moving and shit. But all I know is eventually Sky and um, Barbie started getting into it too. So like they trying to break up both of them. It was just a lot of mess. But. Now they go back up backstage. Jocelyn says she done filming. She just over the bullshit. Bitch, she says she don't want no bitch to touch her. Y'all let bitch to touch her. And then Barbie says she not getting beat up this time. And she's saying Sky look like a rope she's burnt. Now the burnt reads, I don't do. I'm sorry. I'm a really pretty dark skin bitch. I've gotten the burnt reads a lot when I was growing up, when I was little. And these days, the same bitches that was calling me burnt be trying to suck my dick. So it's like... All that, all she burnt, she this, she that, girl, we can't do that. I'm not, I, I never live for the, the colorism stuff. Because, Barbie, how many shades lighter are you? Like, let's be for real. Anybody look like a roach, you literally look like the ants from, like, Bugs Life. And you also look like fucking, y'all know that fucking Barbara from um, Flapjack? <laughs> y'all know the Barbara from Flapjack? Do not tell me that Barbie do not look like him. Like, girl, she be trying to read somebody the ugliest on the show, like, 
sister. You might, your body might be sickening. No shit, you ate your body up. But that face, girl, you should have, you should have put a little work to that face too, because your your facial film would have been cold before you came back for me. But you came back with the steel, with the steel trapezoid face, and it's not eating. Now, why you know Barbie doing all this reading, you know, real like, so why you ain't said that while she was outside? <laughs> and that was funny to me because y'all know real messy as hell, and I live for that. Like he's so messy, like girl, you she, you talk all this about you know this and that. Why you ain't said that when she was here? Thank you. I real say, um, Barbie got her ass beat on the show, and then they asked Barbie about getting her her hair snatched out, and she said that guy's a man, and like you know she take moans, so she's softer. So like if she was fighting any man, you know that would happen to her. I don't like how when the girls like they did this on Zodiac House too, like when the girls get to like popping all that mouth, and then when bitches start running up and smacking them in their mouth, they want to play the oh I'm a girl, like um I I I'm taking hormones, like that's a boy, like no girl if you popping your shit like a boy, you're gonna get beat up like a boy. I'm sorry, don't be going around up in people's face talking crazy to them and thinking you're not gonna get a smack that's a, that goes for anybody dog or dolphin fish anything you out here being rude come around people who disrespected them and they beat you up you're just beat up that's simple they up the live now talking about um you know how they was going back and forth and how josh talked about kenzie brother and stuff they real messy on this show that's also why i just had to like girl scrap the whole bag so now they're talking about how they want to see cashmere and then the camera goes back backstage to cashmere cashmere are you making it so hard to stay in you because you be spitting on people then you put on lingerie and a puffer coat and some boots on and then you in the camera with your hooves all in the screen crackled up just shaking your hair looks nice finally i'm gonna give you that but other than that girl like why would you come to reunion with a lingerie set on and boots that's literally like winter and summer that's that's like day and night i'll i'll why would you come with winter boots a winter coat and some lingerie where do they do that at? Where do they do that at? Anywhere. It's LA. I know you hot. I know your feet sweating, your body cold, your, your shoulders are sweating too. Cashmere, why would you come dressed like that? Liddy actually looked kind of cute with her little um, Burberry bucket head. Um, fucking Nina came to with her braids, her face beat like. Your hair was sickening for once, but girl. The outfit, seriously. Like, and I feel like the South Central girls, you know, they, they not, they don't really get to dress inside. They not the city bitches, but come on now. You know better, at least. When I see my girl Sway was here, I was wondering who that girl who tagged Kenzie up in a trailer like that. And she literally was big as fuck. I'm like, it's gotta be somebody on this show that got hands that can really like get Kenzie and her ex. You know, Kenzie can fight. And I'm like, who could that be? And when I seen Persuasion, I'm like, oh. You the bitch that got her, cause Persuasion can bang. No shade, y'all remember she got that girl in that gas station. She really got them bitches, no shade. So when she said she was on Joyce and Sky Side, I said, oh, okay. <laughs> I see what's up situation. This is bitch. This is an all star situation. Y'all got all the all the heavy hitter bitches back in here. So I'm I'm living at this point. They go back to um they asked Barbie and Kenzie about Kashmir and about how like she switched up on them and then she said she belonged with the trash. She said with the trash. They real tell tell Barbie that they've been handling that she actually been handling her own recently. I don't know where he's seen that at of her handling her own because obviously Barbie getting her ass thrash almost every fight. I mean she did do her little shit in the beginning when she started first fighting Sky, but I don't see her handling much. Sky really dog walked her ass in that hallway, so I'm like, I don't know where she got that from. But bitches wanted me. and they come back they do another little break or whatever and they cast teeth all in the camera again and joy changed her clothes and they say if she want you know you know if she wants smoke they she ready to change the bang so now joyce you know she said she put her bang clothes on kenzie say you know she's tired of scary bitches that's got a lot of mouth she said back in the day if you scary you got to be quiet like if you scary you want supposed to have a lot of mouth understand them because i do hate scary bitches that talk a lot of shit because bitch if you talking a lot of shit you should know how to fight at least back say sky biting joyce nails off or whatever now they all huddled up like playing on them and persuasion on what they gonna do so Sway like, oh, I'm not dick riding nobody. I just don't like no bully ass bitch. I don't think Sway was dick riding, but I feel like she thought she was going to be per perceived as a dick rider because it really didn't have nothing to do with her. But no, girl, you not no dick rider. You just out here trying to fight like everybody else. Bitch, you get your ones, your twos. Bitch, you trying to get your camera time. Bitch, do your big one. Fight me time out. Now they come back to the motherfucking um, show and they bring out Liddy and Nina and Nod. And I guess Nod is on the new show with Sapphire. So that's sickening. So now they all sit on the couch with the sad of Barbie and Kenzie. And then they ask about how Cardi B shouted them out. And Liddy said she wanted a feature or whatever. Now they bring all the other bitches out again. Dun, 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 dun. So now they bring out other bitches out. My girl, Joyce, front and center. 
she front and center like, okay, bitch, you hoes wanna bang, what's up? Y'all wanna bang, what's up? So instantly like, huh, fucking kids square. They're like, nah, 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 let them fight, let them fight. So they finally square up, girl. My girl Joy say, Mao, Mao, Mao. When I tell you, I was surprised when she really gave Kenzie that work. I was surprised. Like y'all know Joyce a big girl, but she was swinging hella fucking fast and literally connected. Like she heard it in her mouth. She tried up her ass. Now, now Kenzie, you know Kenzie stronger than her, so you know Kenzie did do like a hard ass punch back. Like turn, she flipped her ass over and got the punch in her ass. But even when Joyce was on the floor, that bitch was Mao, Mao. So I'm kind of happy because my, I was, I was that no, no shade. Joyce got me up because I'm like, you know, that's my bitch girl. She doing her big one. Like she really. Standing up to the big bag, whooping, doing her big one, so I'm ready for next week. I'm ready for next week, no shade. Fun video, hope you guys enjoyed it, y'all. Follow my social media, my Facebook, my Instagram, my Snapchat. Y'all have to really be updated with me on Instagram if y'all not on YouTube because I be booked like almost every weekend these days. It be lit, busting shows, niggas, woods. It be just like that rapper life and that rapper like celebrity life when you like have a big hit and people really like be dick riding you and they like see you from social media like, oh my god, I know him. I be like, you know me? But you don't know me from YouTube though, you just know me because I'm a rapper. Like, that's sickening. Like, I'm trying to combine my rap fan base and my YouTube fan base so y'all can be here. So you can, but that can't happen unless y'all follow me on my other social media. So make sure y'all go follow my other social media. Period. Let me know if I comments who y'all think gonna bang next motherfucking week. Um, I'm already know Persuasion and Kenzie. I'm looking for that. I'm already knowing Sky and Barbie gonna bang. I'm looking for that too. But I want to see what the girls give me because y'all know Liddy and um, Cashmere got this beef that they didn't have for 30,000 years. I want to see them squash it. No shade. That's the motherfucking video. I'm finna go to my motherfucking audition. You know they know my body, you know. Big body bands, not the little one, you know. Big Rick's not the little ones, you know. So yeah, hopefully I get up on this show so we can come and talk about my own show reviews. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? Period. That's the motherfucking video. And singing, since we out.